The UH-60 Black Hawk helicopter is the U.S. Army primary medium lift utility transport and air assault aircraft. It is a twin-engine medium lift utility helicopter. It is equipped with a single four-bladed rotor and a single four-bladed tail rotor. The basic crew complement for the UH-60 is three, pilot, co-pilot, and crew chief. The titanium cord rotor blades are resistant to AAA, anti-aircraft artillery, fire up to 23 millimeters and are equipped with pressurized sensors capable of detecting loss of rotor pressurization. The model was designed to carry 11 combat troops in addition to a crew of three, pilot, co-pilot, crew chief, and was intended to serve in utility, air assault, medevac, command and control, and reconnaissance roles. The Army began converting Black Hawks to the medevac role in 1981. The UH-60A utilizes a dragging tailwheel landing gear system, with two non-movable main gear struts, and a rotating lockable tailwheel assembly. For operations in Arctic environments, the Black Hawk can be fitted with landing skis. The UH-60 is equipped with troop accommodations for eight, which can be removed to accommodate four full-size medical litters. The Black Hawk can transport 11 fully equipped combat soldiers in an assault-ready configuration or 14 in a maximum capacity situation. Maximum troop carrying capacity is 20 lightly equipped personnel. The dedicated medevac variant of the Black Hawk can accommodate six litters. The UH-60 is equipped with a rearward sliding and lockable door on each side of the cargo compartment. The external cargo hook is rated to 8,000 pounds, 3,630 kilograms. The ESSS external storage support system consists of two external wing-like assemblies attached to the airframe above the cargo compartment doors. Each ESS wing is equipped with two removable pylons. The wings are rated to 5,000 pounds each and can accommodate a single 230-gallon fuel tank, as well as a single 450-gallon fuel tank. This gives the UH-60 an unrefueled self-deployment range of 1,200 nautical miles. Up to 16 Hellfire missiles can be mounted on the ESS and when coupled with the capability to carry an additional 16 missiles internally, gives an armed Black Hawk the ability to rearm itself in admission. The UH-60 is equipped with two General Electric T-700G-701 turboshaft engines rated at 1,560 shaft horsepower each. Internal fuel is stored in two crashworthy fuel tanks and totals 360 gallons. If ESS is equipped, the Black Hawk can carry two 230-gallon external tanks and up to two additional auxiliary 185-gallon tanks internally in the cargo compartment. The Black Hawk is capable of flying on one engine. The UH-60 is equipped with VHF-FM, UHF-FM, and VHF-AM slash FM radios as well as encrypted IFF recognition system. For self-defense, the Black Hawk is equipped with an AN-slash APVR-39 V-1 radar warning receiver, as well as an AN-slash ALQ-144 infrared countermeasures system and chaff-slash flare dispenser. While not equipped with any dedicated weapon systems, the UH-60 is equipped with two pintle mounts, one each located on either side of the airframe aft of the flight deck. These pintles are capable of accepting a variety of weapons to include the M-60 GP 7.62mm machine gun, the M247.62 mm machine gun, the 50 caliber GAU-19 slash and machine gun, as well as the General Electric M134 7.62 mm six-barrel minigun. Utilizing the ESS system, the UH-60A can equip up to 16 Hellfire missiles, as well as 2.75 FLVR folding fin aerial rocket, rocket pods, FIM-92 Stinger anti-air missiles, as well as aerial mine delivery systems, such as the Volcano and the M56 mine delivery system. The UH-60 Lighter's Black Hawk represents an upgrade to the original UH-60 at Black Hawk, which entered service with the U.S. Army in 1978. Production of the UH-60 Lighters began in 1989 with the conversion of existing UH-60 aircraft to the L standard, as well as the production of new airframes. The first UH-60 Lighters was delivered in November 1989. Over 600 have been delivered since 2006, and production is expected to continue until the UH-60 Lighters line is replaced by new production UH-60M aircraft. Externally, the UH-60 Lighters is very similar to the UH-60A. Major improvements include the incorporation of a hover IR suppression system, HIRSS, that is designed to cool engine exhaust gases while hovering in forward flight. As with the UH-60A, the L variant is ESS capable and rated for all of the same weapon systems. The external cargo hook limit has been improved on the UH-60 lighters, which has a maximum lift rating of 9,000 pounds. 
Internal troop carrying capacity remains unchanged at 11 fully loaded, 14 high density, and 20 lightly equipped. The UH-60 Lighters is equipped with two General Electric T700G 401C turboshaft engines, each rated to 1,880 shaft horsepower. The L model retains the same internal fuel arrangements as in the A model.